So I'm here with Becky Newton, mm -hmm. one of the stars of Weird Loners, Yay. upcoming comedy on Fox. Tell me about your character. My character is Karen Goldfarb, probably the most high-strung person you've ever met in your life. <laughs> How so? Just really, really needy to the point where it's like she might explode any second if someone doesn't love her back soon. And she is a dental hygienist. Right, she really loves teeth. Yeah, uh, this show loves teeth because there's, there's another a lot of preferences. dentist, right? I don't or understand why. Or a VP why. of sales at a dentist's office. All I know is there's a lot of mention of dentistry. So mm -hmm. clearly our creator loves teeth. Was really, yeah, really all about the teeth. Yep. Um, okay, now the show sounds a little bit like New Girl in, in ah. concept. Um, sure. Now that may just be because we have like a New Girl producer. Um, yeah, I guess a bunch. What do you think about the similarities? I guess it, it, it is similar in that it's people in close proximity, a bunch of weirdos coexisting. I think the difference is they're not living in the same apartment. They're, they're right. two townhouses next door to each other. So I think it does lend itself to more singular storylines for each character. Yeah. So it's less like the four of them being crazy all the time and it's each person's individual path and sometimes they cross and they cross in sort of all different ways. Okay, um, but so you would say that each character has a pretty solid storyline of their own. Yeah, I do. Okay. I think they have identities and storylines of their own. I know another difference is, unlike a new girl where they may have known each other before, the different characters had right. different previous relationships, these characters have never met. So there isn't this backstory, there isn't this, oh, I've known you for 10 years, This is I've yeah. never met you before, now I suddenly live with you and see you every single day. Yeah. And I think that lends itself to a different kind of comedy because there's, the audience is gonna get to know the characters' relationships as the characters are getting to know each other, right. which is kind of fun. Do you keep in touch with any Ugly Betty castmates and would you do an Ugly Betty movie? I would do an Ugly Betty movie in a heart. Yeah. I would do an Ugly Betty movie if they asked me today, can you come to set tonight, I'd go. It was the best yeah. experience in my life. And I know everyone else is game too, so why isn't this happening? And lastly, what do you want people to know about Weird Loners? I want them to watch it because they're going to laugh. Okay. They're going to laugh, they're going to be really uncomfortable a lot, which I think is really funny. It's like yeah. the weird things people do when they're nervous or when they're happy. Like It's just the weird part of human nature and it, this show will allow us to laugh at it and that's my favorite kind of comedy.